Hi everyone, this is Emmy today. I'm going to show you how to crochet this little crossbody pouch. And it's large enough to hold your cell phone and a credit card and a few other things. So let's get started. If you don't have t-shirt yarn, you could use worsted weight yarn. And you'll need about four strands. One, two, three, four. And that should give you about the same thickness as the t-shirt yarn. Start with a slip knot and work a foundation chain that measures about 11 inches. I started with chain 18. Like that, I chained 18. Single crochet in the second stitch from the hook and in each stitch all the way down the chain. So single crochet in each stitch. All the way down the chain. Like that, I crocheted all the way down the chain. And this is going to wrap over like this and turn down. So that's how long you'll need your work to be. Now for each remaining row, you'll work the same row over and over. Chain one and turn the work. Working in the back side of the stitch only, single crochet. And you're going to single crochet in each stitch all the way down the row. And you're going to keep repeating this row over and over. Like that. Just keep repeating that row over and over. And I have one here that I've gone ahead and worked. And you fold this in half like this. And then this is going to come down like that. So I left a long tail when I started. So now I can slip stitch this side closed and at the end where I fastened off. And at the other end when you fasten off, leave a long tail and then you can just do the same thing. Slip stitch closed. So you do that all the way down the side. Slip stitch. To close it up all the way down this side and this side as well like that I'm going to fold this over like this and I'm going to sew a shank button right here and this is a shank style button it has a little shank underneath and I'm going to sew that right there and I'll do that with some red yarn and a yarn needle And sew that on good and secure like that and now I can just button it through here like that and I made a tassel with that by just wrapping my yarn around my hand as many times as you'd like and then I cut that across like here tie this into a bundle like that and then cut another piece that's about one and a half times the length. Now hold this so that this piece is longer. Wrap it around several times. Like that. Tie a knot. Pull this top strand down. And trim these all the same length and tie the bundle on the side of your bag and you can just tack those on the inside with a needle and thread to make a strap I'm just going to chain a long cord leave enough yarn at the end for attaching it to the purse and go ahead and work a chain that is as long as you would like your crossbody strap to be Like that, make it as long as you would like, and you're going to use these ends, and you're just going to pass that through on the side of the bag, tie a nice square knot, and then pull the ends into the work. And that's it, that's how easy it is to crochet this little crossbody pouch. Thanks for watching, bye for now.